you guys, it's Pixel here. Today we're gonna do something a little bit different. I know we make videos all the time about video games and cool things to do with crafts, but today I'm gonna let you guys get to know a little bit more about me. So I'm gonna make a TMI video tag, which of course means too much information. Be prepared. I have my questions right here. There's about 50 of them. So let's get started. Question number one, what are you wearing? This is the point where I was going to make a cute wizard hat and robe joke, but I couldn't find construction paper to make a wizard hat. So instead, I'll give you the boring answer. A shirt, some pants, some really dirty socks, underwear. Question two, ever been in love? Yes. Question number three, ever had a terrible breakup? Not really, actually. I think I'm pretty much on speaking terms with everyone I've broken up with, except for maybe that one kid in middle school. Sorry. How tall are you? Five foot one and a half. How much do you weigh? So I kind of messed up here too. We were running errands at Target and we went to the bath section where they have the scales because you know how they normally have them out and like kids jump on them all the time and they're like, oh my God, look at how much I weigh. So I went there and they don't have any of the scales actually out anymore. You have to purchase a scale in order to use it. What is that? So I don't actually know. I think the last time I went to the doctor is like around hundred pounds. So any tattoos? No, although I was thinking about doing Mass Effect tattoos right here, right here, Paragon and Renegade. Then someone told me that that was a terrible idea. So I didn't. Seven, any piercings? Mm, just my ears right now. I used to have a vertical labret. Yeah, it's, that's how it's pronounced. It's not labre, because it's not French. Question number eight, OTP. Do you know what OTP means? Oh, the acronym? Google, hell. Urban Dictionary says OTP means one true pairing, meaning your favorite combination of characters in a fandom. Does like Finchel count? That's a pairing. Number nine, a favorite show? I don't actually think I have one anymore. Well, I really like The Bachelorette. The last season was amazing, uh, but this season of The Bachelor kind of let my hopes and dreams down because we learned that Juan Pablo is actually just kind of shallow. Number 10, favorite bands. I used to care about music a lot, and these days I don't. It's something you miss. I miss Spam Missy Bees from Hawaii. I haven't been back in like four years, but I'm going at the end of this month, so I'm really excited to eat all of the Hawaiian foods, yay. Number 12, favorite song. Sweater Weather by The Neighborhood. Love that song. Number 13, how old are you? 23. Number 14, Zodiac Sun. Aries, quality you look for in a partner. He needs to have a good head on his shoulders. I don't date dum-dums. Mm -mm. Number 16, favorite quote. I'm not really good at looking to quotes for inspiration. I feel like I should know a quote or two. We're just, we're just gonna Google an inspirational quote. Imperfection is beauty, madness is genius, and it's better to be absolutely ridiculous than absolutely boring. Number 17, favorite actor. It's probably a toss up between Joseph Gordon-Levitt and Leonardo DiCaprio. Also, Ryan Gosling is hot. Number 18, favorite color. A lot of people think that my favorite color is pink because of my hair or purple, but it's not. I really love turquoise blue, makes me happy. 19, loud music or soft? Loud music if I'm actively listening to it, but if I'm just like relaxing and kicking back, then soft music is totally fine. Where do you go when you're sad? So it's actually not super often that I'm really sad, but I usually hit the couch with some ice cream and a blanket. That's my go-to. 21, how long does it take you to shower? 10 minutes? How long does it take you to get ready in the morning? 30 minutes, I think. Like up to an hour. It depends on like how long I hit the snooze button or I just lie there in bed pondering life. Pondering life is really important to me. Ever been in a physical fight? No, actually. I am pretty non-confrontational and I've just never found myself in that situation. Mm -mm. 24, turn on. Brains, turn off. Ignorance! The reason I joined YouTube. So I started making videos on my own a few years ago. Really the motivation was just to share my love and passion for gaming and now I make videos with the fragiles and it's really just for that same purpose. 27. Fears? Like I don't really have phobias. I think my biggest fear is probably speaking in public and I have a public speaking class this semester so it's been really fun times. Last thing that made you cry. My boo did something really sweet and it made me cry, but in like a really good way. It touched my heart. Last time you said you loved someone. It's been like, it's been like a good two hours, like maybe three. Yeah. 
You three definitely hours. don't love me while, I'm, while we're doing videos. <laughs> <laughs> Meeting behind your YouTube name. So, Fragdoll's POV. Contrary to what some people might believe, this literally just means Fragdoll's point of view. And this is where we keep all of our more personal videos and more just one off funny, cute, and get to know us videos. 31, last book you read. Second novel, Miss Ford series, Well of Ascension. <laughs> the book you're currently reading is this one. Uh, it's the third novel in the Miss Ford series, and this one is The Hero of Ages. And look at where I am, guys. I've been putting off finishing this book forever because it's so good, and I'm literally like this much left and I just can't do it because I don't want the story to end. It's that awesome. Go pick it up. Do it right now. Last show you watched? I think it was probably The Millionaire Matchmaker and I don't know if you can see a trend but I really enjoy trashy reality TV. 34. Last person you talked to is the person behind the camera right now. His name is CZ. He's my boo. The relationship between you and the person you last texted. Saber of the Frag Dolls. She is one of my bestest buddies. I love her. Mm-hmm. Favorite food? Curry. Anything curry. It doesn't matter if it's Japanese, Thai, Indian, whatever. If it's curry and served with like a big bowl of rice, I will consume it. I love me some curry. Place you want to visit? I would just love to go to Japan. So yeah, you can whisk me off to the countryside, plot me in a city, whatever. I will totally love it and embrace it. Last place you were? In the car? Do you have a crush? Jennifer Lawrence. Last time you kissed someone, I don't know, like three hours ago. Last time you were insulted, I think this probably happened every time I stream, probably. There's usually like a troll that is bound to come in and says something really stupid. A favorite flavor of sweet? Like orange sweet? Like strawberry sweet? I was, what, what kind of question is that? What instruments do you play? I played piano for seven years and I was pretty good at it and then I decided to rebel against my mom and I was like, no mom, I will not take any more piano lessons. I'm gonna sit here and farm and play World of Warcraft and you cannot keep the purples from me. Favorite piece of jewelry? This one, there's really nothing that special about it other than the fact that I still own it because I lose absolutely everything. Last sport you played. <laughs> Last song you sang. I sing a lot of weird songs to my cats. They're original compositions written mostly by me, in part by CZ. 47. Favorite chat-up line. Hey, did you know that your drink matches your hair? This is when I have like the cran apple vodka like chilling in my hand. Have you ever used it? No. Last time you hang out with anyone. I'm hanging out with people right now. I've got like my two cats. I've got CZ behind the camera. Life is good. 50. Who should answer these questions next? You and you and you and the guy back there and that guy back there should probably answer these questions next. Thank you guys so much. I hope you enjoyed this style of video. I know it's a little bit different, but again, be sure to leave this video a thumbs up if you want to see more like it. And don't forget to subscribe here and to the main Fragdolls channel. You can do so by clicking here and right there. Bye guys.